I want to share a little bit uh, of uh, situation we had with uh, AAA tow truck and basically uh, over the weekend my daughter my daughter's car simply died luckily not on the freeway but in Hollywood somewhere due to a uh, fail alternator so we call AAA and we try to tow it to you know close to my house which is about 100 miles well not 100 miles I'm sorry like 40 miles but triple a gave it gave me a hard time and they they say they can only um uh, tow it for like seven miles because i had maxed out on my membership uh i had maxed out the four calls per year so anyway uh make make long story short these uh I think it's kind of like a scam. They, they, the the triple A tow truck probably was working with local non triple A auto shops. So without us knowing, they drop not us but my daughter off at uh, this not very good area. I, I wouldn't say the name, you know, somewhere in uh, uh, near Santa Monica Boulevard, and uh, actually it wasn't a triple A approved auto and we didn't know that so the next day when when we were going to pick it up they told us that you know if they you know basically i'm not gonna have the car fixed there i don't know them uh so i arranged to have um to use another membership card and and get uh, the car towed gonna be towed to uh to my mechanic about 30 miles away but the the, the body shop you know turn around and say that well you're gonna have to pay a 60 dollar uh, storage fee but i told them that triple a told me that it's free but then they came back they said that we're not triple a approved so pay us you know whatever so i say okay give me the receipt and i'll i'll file the claim with triple a and then the guy went back the owner went back and uh you know apparently he wasn't happy I wasn't happy neither, you know. I think I, I was scammed by the, the tow truck guy. So make long story short, the auto shop decided not to charge me but went into like a little yelling match and telling him that the triple A tow truck driver should not drop me at the non triple A auto shop because you know then I don't have a protection from from triple A, right? So you guys make sure that because some sometime, you know. I don't know it's a scam uh, you know the tow truck driver we work with uh, local body sh um, local auto shops because that's their one of their you know I mean when customer car break uh, cars break down they'll take it to auto shops and that's their revenue coming in pretty good I mean you know of course they try to keep you there and fix your car there and that that's really high revenue because um, when you when your car you know stall or die on you, you actually have nowhere to go. You have to tow to another place, so uh, it, it's very difficult. So you sort of at their mercy, you know. So you gotta be sure as the I know it, it's difficult when when you have problem with you know car stall. You are so nervous and you worry and you need to get home and blah blah blah. But make sure they take you to uh, a triple A authorized uh, auto shop. If it's late in the evening, uh, they'll keep your car over there overnight uh, free without charge. And you know, uh, at least that is based on what I know from AAA customer service. I can ver verify that or maybe you guys can verify that. I think, well actually I call AAA and they say it should be free. But because of this tow truck, you know, knowingly or unknowingly, you know, drop us on a on a private shop and now they want their uh, storage fee because you know I'm not gonna have to fix my car so be, be careful there's a scam there and, and you can end up you know uh, being at the wrong place and end up spending a lot of money fixing their car because it seemed like this shop was trying to like you know oh yes yeah, it's, it's your alternator but then you smell something you know they smell something bad in there basically kaching 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 for them okay so I'm not saying you know it's it's they're always bad, but just be be cautious, you know, and make sure you, uh, in case of uh, your, your car stall or die on you, hopefully you, you'll be safe, you're not gonna be on a freeway, 
or you know try to get away from the freeway as much as as much as as fast as possible and then make sure you you go to the the right uh, AAA place at least you have protection two-year protection on their work you know so you have that protection all right hope that helps have a good night